Okay. Well, we are really excited to be here, Marcy and I. We are going to be discussing all the weight loss recipes within the CR500 weight loss program. So it's going to be really fun, just kind of a little sneak preview into how we put the foods together to keep it really, really simple. And this is Marcy's amazing kitchen here. So you're going to, I just think it's really cool. Thank you, Marcy, for letting us. Okay. So throughout this book, all of these recipes, what we're, we're just going to focus on a few of them, but the fantastic basic chicken is one of my very favorites. Um, we're just going to bake it in a pan. That way you have little um, individual pieces of chicken that you can have ready to go whenever you're ready. And the thing I love so much about the fantastic basic chicken, besides it tastes so good, is that it's really, really tender. So you can take it right out of the fridge and eat it cold, or you can warm it up and eat it hot and not have it be all dried out. So that's what we're going to do really, really quick. Now, Marcy, one little trick that I do that's really important because I love seasonings. Let's go ahead and grab our seasonings back here and we'll just kind of bring those all over here. I always put seasonings all over the bottom of the pan. Um, and then as we measure these um, and put them in, I'm gonna put them into little clusters so that you can pick out real easily your 100 gram portions when you're done. Okay, so yeah, go ahead and put, we're gonna put some salt in the bottom. That's great and some pepper. Okay. Hey, Marcy, will you grab that Braggs? Yep. Have you tried this? I have. And? It's very flavorful. It's good, good stuff for the diet because flavor is key in this diet. <laughs> you know, it's so you want flavor. Okay, really, she didn't really mean that. This is delicious food. No, I'm just kidding. No, it is good food, but anything you can do to add more flavor. I totally agree. Yeah. This Bragg's organic sprinkle is so amazing. There's 24 herbs and spices, totally legal on the diet. Season your food. Please make your food taste good so that you enjoy it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're just going to sprinkle a little bit on the bottom of the pan, just like we did with the salt and pepper. And then we're going to measure our chicken into the 100 gram portion. So make sure that you have a digital scale. Um, you can get these several different places. One of the cheapest places we've found is at Walmart, and it's a digital postal scale. I think that is mentioned in the book, in the in the bright gold pages. So That's where this one came from. So. Oh, good. So we're going to put that, just turn that on and make sure it reads grams. Okay, let's see. We are at 92 grams, so we need a little bit more. So, and I love this assembly line, Marcy. This is where you're going to come in handy, okay? Really handy. Oh, dang. Can you believe that? It's 110 now. We cut that. And then what we're going to do, perfect. And rolling. Okay, so now that we've measured our 100 grams, we're just going to stick that into the pan. And we're going to tuck those little pieces. I keep them really close together, and then they stay separated like that. So I kind of make, what I do is I make a pattern. I'll do a, the big piece on the left and then the little piece on the right so that I can tell for sure exactly where my 100 grams in. To use is using a toothpick to just actually attach that smaller piece to the larger portion. I'm out of toothpicks right now, but that helps for me, especially if I'm not using a baking pan, if I'm grilling on my grill or even my George Foreman, because that little piece is heaven. <laughs> you don't want to lose that piece. That last little bite. <laughs> that last little bite, you want it. Oh, okay, so we're just gonna keep going right along. Oh, my thing timed out. So, and this is where it's great. This is the assembly line. So you come home from the grocery store, and we're going to get this in the oven in like five minutes. It's going to cook for 20, and then we're done. We've got at least a week's worth, if not probably two weeks worth of food right here in this chicken. So that's going to be awesome. Okay, so this one's 104. Let's take a little off. Good job. Perfect. Okay, would you going to go ahead and stick that in? And we'll just keep going. That would, have been that would be really important. Okay. For an Arizona lemon, that's not super juicy. I think we need to do another one. Because we want this chicken to be like swimming in lemon juice. Okay, can I try this? Yes. Move your fingers. <laughs> I can't juice my fingers too. Okay, alrighty. That's probably good. Do I need to do something else? Okay. And I'm just going to pour this all over the chicken. Sometimes when I do a small pan and I'm kind of lazy, I just squeeze it on. That's a good juicy lemon. So that's really good. I kind of pour it around to get it kind of dispersed evenly. That gives so much flavor. Okay, Marcy, let's salt and pepper it again. And I'll brag it. <laughs> 
Tashka. Okay, so we've got the chicken completely placed in there and all the lemon juice and the seasonings all over and it's ready to go in the oven. So it's at 325 for 20 minutes. Watch that really carefully. You don't want to overcook it because you want it to stay really juicy and tender. Okay, it looks like our chicken is done. Oh, yummy, yum, yum. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now that it is completely done, you can just kind of tell where the little sections are. And so what I usually do is I'll leave this out on the counter, let it cool just enough and we put these in little Ziploc sandwich, uh, not the sandwich size, these snack size bags. Works really, really good. But I'll have to show you that later. But each little individual portion I put inside these to keep all the juices. And sometimes I even pour a little juice into each one. So, and then we'll have a bag full of chicken. We're gonna let this cool. But in the meantime, we're all hungry, so we're gonna eat. Okay, so I think everybody should line up, you know, all of our backstage crew. All of our Staff, makeup our fans, artists, all of our fans, all of our fans, mm -hmm. makeup artists, hairdressers. Nice. So this is the chicken plate. This is a, the fantastic baked chicken. You can obviously pick any fruit or vegetable that you would like. So we've got the baked chicken, the esteemed asparagus, the apples. This is one of my favorites.